Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. Chat in Windows 11 is a modified version of the Microsoft Teams personal app you can quickly access from the desktop taskbar to meet or chat with your contacts. To sign in to chat in Windows 11, click the chat icon in the Windows 11 taskbar to open the pop-up chat window. Then click the Get Started button to open the Microsoft Teams personal app sign-in window. To sign in with your current Microsoft account used to sign in to Windows 11, click it to select it. To use a different Microsoft account, click the Use Another Account link to sign in with a different Microsoft account. Alternatively, to get Microsoft Teams for work or school, Click the Get Microsoft Teams Work or School link to download the full Microsoft Teams app for your work or school account in a separate browser window. After signing in, you then see the Microsoft Teams personal app. To view activity, chats, or your calendar, click the Activity, Chat, or Calendar button at the left side of the window. To close the app, click the X button in its upper right corner. To quickly sync contacts in the chat window in Windows 11, click the Chat button in the taskbar. Then click the Sync Your Contacts button to open a Find People You Know window. Then click the button for the contact source from which to sync. You can then close this window when finished. After first making a chat in the chat window, the Sync Your Contacts button then appears as the Sync button. Alternatively, to chat with someone in the chat window in Windows 11, click the Chat button in the taskbar. Then click the Start a Chat button to open a chat window. Then type their name, email, or phone number into the To field. Then type the Chat message to send into the Type New Message field, and click the Adjacent Send button, which looks like a paper airplane. The chat then appears in the chat window, where you can click it to open it and read and respond to it. After creating a chat, the Start a Chat button then appears as the Chat button in the chat window. Alternatively, to immediately start a new meeting, click the Make a Call button to open a new meeting window and then select whom to invite to the meeting by clicking the desired button in the Invite People to Join You window that opens to send a link to the meeting via copy-paste, Outlook Calendar, Google Calendar, or via email. After creating a chat, the Make a Call button then appears as the Meet drop-down button in the chat window. Alternatively, to open the full Microsoft Teams personal app after you create your first chat, Click the Open Microsoft Teams link at the bottom of the chat window. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.